when the narcissist becomes obsessed. The narcissist will obsess over certain people. People who they may not even know. They will attach themselves until those other people choose to disengage. But narcissists cannot deal with rejection. They cannot deal with being dismissed or refused. So then they start a smear campaign. They start saying horrible things about that person to other people. You may try to disconnect from the narcissist, but they use victim playing as an excuse for their behavior, which never justifies what they do. They're just getting emotional because you don't want to deal with them, because you figure them out, because you've realized what they really are. But without your knowledge, they have created this relationship in their minds. In their minds, you're together. Because they've lost contact with reality. They have these delusions. They have these false beliefs about you. And they cannot cease to support their way of thinking and feeling about you. Because of these obsessive thoughts in their minds, which you are not participating in. And if you completely cut them off, they're very disappointed. Because they have these fantasies in their minds of who they think you are and what they think you're going to be for them but it never becomes a reality. So they start to create disturbance. They're chasing after you. Even though you want nothing to do with them. They're making it seem like it's more than what it is. as though they're deeply involved with you. As though they know you so well. When you don't even know who they are. You may have just seen them a few times, but in their minds, they know you. You're together. Which is why you end up with this insane and wildly out of control person who is obsessed with you. Because they're completely delusional. They can't escape their own fantasy that they have created in their mind which makes it difficult for you to escape them. Because if you have social media, they will still be following you. They will still be watching you. While they're making false and damaging statements about you. which is not normal behavior because a normal person doesn't like something, they're not going to keep going back to it. But the narcissist will return to the very things they say are not good because there is something wrong with them, which is why they're not going to stop 
because they're completely obsessed with you. They can't let you go. They can't move on. Because they're becoming progressively worse from not being able to control you or be an influence in your life. Because you don't want anything to do with them. And you cannot just be friendly with them because they have these fantasies in their mind. So they're going to want all or nothing. You can't just be happy to accept the situation or suggestion. You can't try to be friends. You have to completely disengage from them because they don't want a slice of the pie. They want it all or nothing. So being friendly is not going to be good enough for them, especially if you have already rejected them. They will be lurking in the shadows. They will be spying on you because there's these feelings and memories in their mind which causes them to think that they're missing out on something and there's nothing they can do to stop it. They have issues with everyone they come across. They can never be in agreement with anyone because they're given their attention to these unusual thoughts which causes them to take inappropriate action. It causes them to be very unsociable where they're not enjoying or making an effort to behave sociably in the company of other people where they're not inclined by nature to a feeling of friendship or to the enjoyment of talking to someone. Instead, they behave in a wild and uncontrolled way because they were raised without cultivation or care. Which will result in them rejecting people who may desire friendship. But then they will stalk and harass people who are rejecting them. People who are just trying to get away. Because they're making these agreements in their mind that you are unaware of. But then they expect you to fulfill this agreement, which they never brought to your attention. So for this reason, they may become obsessed with you. They may continue to spy on you. But now that you have this information, it should make it easier for you to deal with them. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonate with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.